will be this something like this will be developed as part of the public uh, permit application. And so that you know when that when they're ready to move forward with everything, this will be updated and finalized, and then that becomes part of the the permit application. Well, it would be of great interest to the communities to, to study this. Okay. Yeah. I'll, we can, can we can probably get it on the website for you. On your website? Our, yeah, our Stiles Park Farms. Yeah, and with a little bit of an explanation of, uh, for most people don't know what 50 and 45 decibels translates yeah. to. So, we, so uh, we tried to do what we could in yeah. this type of forum, and so just all we have here is a, yeah. a little sound level. So here. part of why we're here tonight is to yeah. talk to people, kind so, of explain this sort of thing. So how do you uh, describe 45 decibels? I, I, so I, I think it's hard to make a direct correlation. It's hard to do a simulation. In this room now, it's 70. Yeah, well, so people are interested in what 45 or what 40 sounds like. I think our best suggestion is to try to visit some of these operating projects in the area to get a sense based on distance. And, and what well, the difficulty is when, when visit near a turbine, let's say in Lempster, where I have been, the sound is not the same as the sound is here at a distance, depending on the topography. Well, I, I think, you know, if you're, if you're a thousand feet away, you know, I don't know where you were at in Lempster versus other projects, but if you're a thousand feet away or two thousand feet away, you know, you'll get a sense of what what it's like under those conditions. And that's that's I mean that that really is kind of the that really is kind of the best approach. I mean I can't tell you what it sounds like because it's hard to Well so one visit is also hardly enough to you know one visit is just based upon what's happening that day on the conditions. Yeah, so if it's not a, if it's not a windy day and they're not operating it's not a productive visit. So that, what are some right. of the other factors that influence the, uh, the noise levels? Uh, well, I think you know wind speed, you know, is, is really the wind speed and distance are really kind of the primary ones because the turbine sound level will increase with increasing wind speed to a certain level, and then it will plateau. Uh, and then what we'll see is, you know, as you can kind of see here, distance is kind of a, a pretty dominant factor as well. So those are really the, those are really kind of the dominant factors. That so what come about in. season, humidity? So season, ice, season, rain. So, se yeah, so season would come into effect in terms of the level primarily of, of ambient noise. So if you you know if you went to an area that had a bunch of deciduous trees and you went during a windy day in the summer versus a windy day in the winter, that's gonna that's probably gonna make a difference uh, in terms of what the what the sum of that is, is, is uh, in terms of project what we're looking here is kind of again we're kind of the vendor information and we're looking at their their rated maximum rated maximum sound level. Now does Ibadrilla have any experience with this particular turbine? Or oh, this is new I understand this particular turbine. The best is this particular model we don't have any operating facilities. This would be the first one. And this is a larger turbine than what we have previously installed? This is a larger turbine than what you see at some of these other facilities. Yeah. So we are guessing a little bit here about the sound implications. Is that fair to say? Uh, there's there's no empirical, there's there's no evidence, no information based yeah. upon other well, projects. Well, we get the information. Uh, yeah. I think, the and I think Vestas would, be, you know, Vestas is the one who kind of develops that information. Right. Yeah. So. You you get the manufacturer's technical data, but there's yes. no there's no actual experience. No. Well, I think Vestas. Uh, yeah. Uh, they're, 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 